Hey guys, it's Kylie, and in today's Vlogmas video, I'm gonna be opening up some of the Heroes vs. Villains mystery pins. So you might have seen my pin haul from the Heroes vs. Villains pin event. Um, today I'm going to be opening up the mystery boxes I got. I got two of the different mystery sets. There was three total mystery sets, I believe. I got two different ones. I got um, the Heroes vs. Villains mystery pin set that has the pins to go in the welcome pin, or really like the goodbye welcome gift. And then I also got the heads and tails. These ones are limited edition of 9,000, and I'm not sure the limited edition of these ones or if they're limited release, um, but super awesome pins. I have two boxes of these and ten boxes of these to open up. And for this one, I definitely have some favorites. This one I'm not as keen. There's some that I'm hoping for, um, but we're excited to open all these up. If you guys want to see more Vlogmas videos on this channel all about Disney, definitely the subscribe button, turn the bell so you get notified every time I upload, posting a video every single day leading up to Christmas. And I'm super excited to dive into these pins and excited to see them in person. Um, and as I go through them, I will tell you the ones I'm looking for. I think I'm gonna do the two boxes of the heads and tails first, and then we're gonna do all 10 boxes of the Heroes vs. Villains ones. Um, these ones each have two pins in them. It's an eight pin collection set. Um, and they are heads versus tails, so they flip around front and back, and they are limited edition of 900. It's hard to see by looking at the box, but there's a Chicken Little one that I definitely would like to get. I wouldn't mind Wreck-It Ralph or Zootopia. Um, those are probably the other two that I would say I'm looking for, um, but I'm not really picky about these ones as much. I just thought they were cool pins. There's definitely some favorites of mine in the other set. So opening up, these ones are definitely heavier than that other mystery set. Um, there's two pins in each one. They feel like pretty good sized pins. I'm going to pull open both boxes and then we're going to open up our four pins. Obviously we're hoping not for doubles on any of these. If I don't get the ones I'm wanting, I might trade for them, um, and try to find the ones I need. If not, um, they'll probably, the ones, if they're ones I don't want, I might just have them up for trade in general. Um, I'm going to cut open these four bags without looking in them. I'm just going to top off the top so that they're easy. We can open them one right after the other. They do look like they have... Um, some of them have like a little pull tab on them. It's funny, one of them was like a slightly different bag than the others. But we're gonna start off with this first one. They're definitely some big pins. Let's see, it actually feels like they're protected with some paper. Um, so they do have paper around them, which adds that mystery and pulling it off. Okay, so this first one we got is the Mickey and Mortar Mouse one. Um, so it says heads or tails, heroes or villains. And then on the front, and then I'm going to pull off the Mickey back so that we can actually spin this around. But all you do, these are limited edition 900, is you can just spin this around. So on the back you have Mortar or Mouse, and then on the front you have Mickey Mouse for your heroes versus villains. Um, these have years on them too, so these say 1936, and then they also have 21 because that's the year of the event. Um, here's what the back, on the round the back edge you can see they have like the pin trading information, um, the event log, like information and some of that in the limited edition, but super awesome, pretty heavy, like they're thick pins. You can see um, they're probably like a good like I don't know I'd say like a half a centimeter thick they're pretty thick pins um, so they're really nice and heavy um, the next one we're opening up again any of these really just hoping not for doubles um, probably more common in the other mystery set than this one but let's see what we got and this one I think this is the one I wanted yes it is it is Chicken Little so another good classic 2000s movie to add to kind of my like 2000s pin collection um, is Chicken Little and then on the back we have Foxy Loxy um, so flipping it around you can see it has the date of 2005 on it and then the 20 21 logo so it just says 21 in like a small font and then it has 2005 in like that bigger font but super awesome you can spin it around um super cute the cool thing is um it's hard to tell but they're actually like almost facing each other so if you look on this side he um foxy's facing one way and then chicken little is actually like facing the other way if they're kind of like heads are even um on the same side so super cool um, this is definitely the one, one of the ones I wanted, um, to add to my collection. So very excited that we got that on our second pull, um, opening up our next bag, hoping for no doubles and we'll see. Oh, this one's a fun one. This one is Hades and Hercules. I know this is a popular one for many people. This has the year 1997 on it. Um, so you got ha Hercules on one side and then you spin it around and you have Hades. So another awesome one of those pins. And then for our fourth one, we see 
No Double Yes. This is an awesome one again too. 1998 for this one. And it is Mulan and Sean Yu. Um, another super awesome one. So Mulan on one side and Sean Yu on the other side. I definitely can't complain about what we got. Um, out of all the ones we got, I don't think, yeah, there's any that I like really wanted that I didn't get. Um, and I could always trade if there's ones I decide later I want, but very excited that we got the Chicken Little one. Um, definitely the one I wanted the most. So I got some, a couple of these left on the hero side, a couple left on the villain side, but super awesome pins. And now we're going to dive into the other mystery set. So for this set, um, here are all the different options. There's 32 pins in the set. Okay. So I think it shows all 32 on the back. Um, there are also the Mickey and the Chernabog that came with the welcome pin as well. On um, this, I'll show you up close, but I'm definitely hoping for the bug in, Buzz and Zerg. Um, I wouldn't mind the Iron Man one. Um, I think it's Luke and Darth is one of these. They're hard to tell in the little images. Um, some of the Star Wars ones I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind completing a lot of these. I have 10 um, and each box has three pins in it. So I do have a chance of getting a lot of them. I have heard from some people that already opened them that it's like a pair and then one bonus one in each. So hoping for not a lot of doubles. I obviously can trade if I do get a bunch of doubles to try to get some of the different ones I want. Um, we got Jack and Oogie Boogie. Lots of awesome characters. So we're just going to dive into these. I think I'm going to open up a few of the boxes and dump out them um, so that they're more of a mystery. So I'm not just opening up, you know, two characters back to back. Uh, I'm going to pour them all, all the black bags out together and then we're going to mystery grab from those black bags. So I just poured out all 30 of our black blind bags and now I'm going to just kind of cut open up them and we're going to dive in to see what we got. Um, definitely a lot of different ones. Who knows what we're going to get. I did try to do this so that I mixed together the boxes so that I wasn't seeing whether the boxes were two of one style or not. Just kind of diving in to see what we got as more of a mystery and not like an expectation that when we dive in that it's going to be a certain character. Um, so pulling them out, they do have that paper around the outside of them. And the first one we got is Mulan. Um, so awesome first add to our collection. The next one we got, I think they do need to be cut open. They can't really be ripped open. Um, so we're just going to put a little slit in each one of them. The next one we have is, I'm going to kind of rapid fire these. Um, it looks like it's one of the, I always screw this up. I can't tell if this is like supposed to be, it's some sort of Mandalorian. I always mess up which ones are which for the Mandalorian characters. Um, so awesome little ad. Yeah. I'm going to mess up if I try to name some of these characters. Um, so I'm just going to open a bunch of them and I'll name the ones I know, but there's definitely a few of these that on here that I just am totally blanking on their names. Um, but if you want, if you have their names, definitely let me know in the comments down below. The next one we have is another hero. So we got, we're on a row of heroes. This one is Black Panther. Um, these are limited release um, pins. I'm trying to do these a little bit on like a rapid fire and I can show you a close up of all of them at the end. Okay, we got another hero. This one is Iron Man. Um, super awesome one following Iron Man. We have, okay, this is um, I think our first villain. Yep. I think this is one of our first villains. It is one of the ducks. I think this is the duck from Darkwing Duck, but I'm not exactly sure his name. So it is our first villain. In our next one, we have oh another villain. We got Oogie Boogie. And then following Oogie Boogie. Okay, we got the Hunchback of Notre Dame. So the Hunchback from that, I think, is that Quasimodo? I believe that's Quasimodo. I'm probably butchering his, screwing up his name, but I believe that's who it is. Um, the next one we have, oh, to go first pair we got is Jack to go with Oogie Boogie. Okay, so diving into our next one, we have, okay, I'm not sure this character's name. He goes with the Headless Horseman, um, but another new one, so that's good. Uh, on all of these, I'm kind of just hoping for new ones and not doubles. Okay, of course, as I say that, we do get our first double. Um, so we're not gonna definitely, and I didn't think we would complete the set, um, but we do have one Star Wars one as a double. Diving into our next one, we're still hoping for Buzz and Zerg. Those are the ones I'm looking forward to the most. Okay, so not a double, but it makes a pair. Um, we got Darkwing Duck. Um, we, diving into our next one, I have cut these all open, so I'm just gonna kind of dive through them quickly. Um, I believe this one goes with... It's the kid from Sword in the Stone. Um, I'm going to screw up the name, but that's the evil guy from it. So the villain. Um, still hoping for Buzz and Zerg. Okay. Nope. But we got Shen Yu to go with Mulan. Um, that kind of goes with our heads and tail one we opened earlier. 
opening up our next one. Okay, awesome. This was actually a good one. I wouldn't was kind of looking forward to. It's Moana. Um, then following that. Okay, yep, another one I wanted. Um, this is oh, I'm gonna screw up his name from a bug's life, but super cute. Definitely one I wanted actually for my collection. Um, so super awesome. Still open for Bug Buzz and Zerg. Um, they're definitely the ones I wanted the most from this set. Or Darth Vader and Luke Skywalker. Um, so this one actually goes with um, the Mandalorian. So we got another Star Wars set to add to my Star Wars collection, but not the Star Wars set I was looking for. Um, going through... Okay. We got... I always screw up names for the Bugs Life characters, but the evil bug in the Bugs Life characters. So another pair. Um, super awesome. That's actually one I wanted for my collection. So another awesome pair to add to my collection. I grew up watching Bugs Life. It was one of my grandmother's favorite movies. So we watched it all the time. Um, so super awesome one. This one is... Okay. Perfect. I always screw up these names. I just can't pronounce it, but it's Little Coconut Guys from Moana. So that's another pair to add to our collection. Our next one. Okay. This is a double. It is Black Panther. So we're on our only our second double, which isn't too bad. Still open for Buzz and Zerg. If not, I'm going to have to trade for those because those are the ones I really want for my collection. You don't see a lot of Zerg pins. So, okay. Here is the evil guy from Hunchback of Notre Dame. And let's see what we got next. Come on, Buzz and Zerg. Ah, oh, yes. So we got Buzz. Super excited. Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger Spin is one of my favorite rides. That's why I like some of these Buzz and Zerg pins. And you don't see a lot of Buzz um, and Zerg pins. So super awesome. Definitely excited for that one. One of my favorites. I wanted that. And then the um, Bugs Life characters. And then the Luke and Darth Vader ones are the ones I really wanted. So hopefully those are some of the other ones we have. Okay, another double. Um, still looking for Luke, and Z Luke, Darth Vader, and Zerg as three of the ones... I want, yes. Okay, so we got Luke Skywalker for our little battle with Darth Vader. He's hard because he's all gray. It's hard for it to, the camera to focus on him. Um, let's see what we got. Okay, um, another new one. I'm look, I keep looking over at the box set that uh, has everything um, to go with Robin Hood. The bad guy to go with Robin Hood, but not um, one I wanted, but still another new one. Any new ones we get is still a good, um, it's better than getting a ton of doubles. We're hoping for the ones that we're still looking for for our own set. This one is... Is it one we want? Okay, another new one. Um, this goes with Iron Man. But still not the ones we want. We have five more left. And there's three we're really looking for. So let's hope we can get those three. If not, definitely we'll be trying to make a trade for those ones. Let's see what we got. Okay, Robin Hood. So we have four left, and there's three we're really hoping for still. Let's see what we got. Is it one we want? Nope. It's the Headless Horseman. So another awesome one, another new one. Um, but we're down to three, and there's three we want. Let's see how well our luck is. I don't know if our luck's that good. Um, but we have got, we only got, I think, three doubles so far. Um, three or four doubles. So that's actually pretty good, in my opinion. Um, we did open 30 pins, and there's 32 in the set. So, to only get three doubles is pretty good. Oh, as I say that, we got a fourth. So, I'll definitely be trading for... Um, actually, never mind. There's actually only two we need. So, we only need Zerg and Darth Vader, I think, are the only two we need. As I say, there was three, but we got Luke. So, maybe we can get it. Let's see if we can complete it. And... Nope. Okay. So, we got a double. Um, this is the bad guy for Iron Man, the villain for Iron Man. Um, so, we're hoping for either Zerg or Darth Vader. If not, those are the two I will be trading for... Um, probably by the time this video comes out, I will hopefully have already traded for them. Okay, and then another one of the bad guy from A Bug's Life. So we weren't able to get Zerg, and we weren't able to get Darth Vader. Definitely two I will be trading for. Um, I'm going to go through and put these all in, like, the order that they're on on this box, and then I'll show you a close-up of all of them. So here's a quick close-up of all the pins. There was eight we didn't get from the set. We have six doubles. Um, still super awesome. I'm definitely going to be trading for Zerg. Um, Darth Vader. I think those are definitely the two I really want to trade for. Um, I didn't get any. There was two sets I didn't get any from, and it's Scrooge McDuck set and the Yzma, um, and Kronk set were the two I didn't get any from. But overall, not too bad. Um, I'll be keeping definitely some of the Star Wars ones, Marvel's ones. 
um, Bugs Life and some of that for my collection, but I probably will have some of these other ones up for trade. Um, first trading my doubles to hopefully get the ones I need from the set, um, but super awesome. Definitely happy with the way this set came out. Happy with all these different awesome mystery sets. They look super awesome with um, the little like welcome goodbye gifts. Super awesome to add all these different awesome hero and villain sets to this, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, definitely hit the subscribe button to see more Vlogmas videos on my channel, more pin openings, and I will see you guys later. Mm -hmm.